water footprint is a supply chain indicator of water use. So it shows for a certain product how much water is being used in all steps along the supply chain. And that's interesting because in many places in the world there, is, uh, there are water intensive uh, processes, also water pollution. Uh, in many places this leads to over exploitation uh, and water pollution problems. So it's interesting for a product to know where it comes from and, and whether the product somehow relates to uh, water pollution or water over exploitation in its supply chain. If we look at the water footprint of uh, whole nations, we look at uh, what is being consumed within the country and then we see differences uh, all over the world. We see uh, developing countries like China and India with a relatively low water footprint per capita. On the other hand, we have countries like the USA and uh, also uh, southern European countries that have a huge water footprint per capita, uh, sometimes more than twice the global average. Then we have countries like the UK, Ireland, um, and Germany, the Netherlands that have a water footprint around the global average. For governments, it would be most appropriate if they set water footprint caps per river basin. It means that there is a maximum amount of water available per river basin, the maximum add of the rain in a, in a basin. So a water footprint cap will make sure that the water footprint within a basin will not exceed the maximum sustainable water footprint. So this is what governments should do in every catchment in the world. And also what they should do is promote water use efficiency. For instance, by formulating water footprint benchmarks by product so that there is an incentive for companies to reduce the water footprint of their products down to the benchmark. And finally, of course, we should address the issue of equity. Some countries in the world, the consumers have a much bigger water footprint per capita than in other countries. So we may need something like a Kyoto Protocol for Water that arranges and, and makes sure that our water footprint reduction targets per country.